It's Friday. So this is the beginning of a seven-day videographer's retreat in Thailand in this hotel with these people for this special guest. This was the first full day of our adventure. Let's get started. Adrian, uh, you want coffee or tea? Uh, tea. So I'm here on a retreat thing with Potato Jet and a bunch of other videographers and it's kind of amazing. So far, everyone seems like a really chill person. But, you guys have probably seen my review on it. Oh! oh, oh what? Oh, I had no idea. Because, yeah, you had no idea? I had really? no idea. You had no idea? <laughs> yeah, I almost threw it out a bunch of times. Yeah. All right, so, everyone just ambush Alan and grab your cameras. It's not easy to smuggle all of this shit. Uh, <laughs> yeah, what did Custom say? Jeez. Thank you. Wow. Yeah, what did Custom say about this? Uh, they're like, you can't carry that much battery. And I was like, okay, they're like t really tiny, small batteries. <laughs> we all just got free Insta360 cameras. What? While we continued to marvel at the gift we'd just been given and the surreality of where we were, we finished introductions and Jean gave us a lot of personalized advice and general video tips. After that, it was off to lunch and then the real adventure began. So we're at a temple now. We go in soon. It looks real nice. There's monks walking around. So before we actually got to begin our tour of the temples, we had to rush down the street to make our appointment with this monk. And although we didn't know who he was. Oh, Zarikab. Oh, I saw your YouTube channel. Wow. Oh, yeah. <laughs> yeah. You review about the camera. Yeah. Yeah. <laughs> His famous one, right? Yeah. 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 Wow. You know. Well, I feel a little bit exciting today. There's so many cameras. This is. <laughs> oh, my Buddha. So we just went into a temple and. A Buddhist monk named Son told us a lot about like his practices and stuff, so that was really cool. He talked about like real happiness is what he called it, which is basically getting away from material possessions and stuff and finding balance, so that was really cool. And then also what I found interesting was at least like the Thailand monks, they go out every morning and they collect food, like they have these little bowl things and they don't ask for food, they just accept whatever is given to them. And they're not vegetarian here either. So I thought that was really cool. Very humbling that they do that every morning for food. And yeah, it was a great experience. We learned to meditate. And now we're gonna see some more temples. Well, we have to wake up early morning, around four or five uh, a.m. Okay, monks ringing the bell. Ding, ding, ding. After wake up, we do morning chanting together around 40 or one hour, and after that we meditate 20 to 30 minutes, silent meditation. After that we clean around the temple until 6 or 6:30. We will go to collecting food. We have breakfast together. After breakfast, we will go to study in the university in the school. So we will spend whole day in the school. But someday people, Buddhist people, will invite Buddhist monk to do some special ceremony. For example, uh, people in the village pass away or die. They will invite Buddhist monk to do the funeral ceremony. Five or six, we will go back to the temple and clean around the temple. Until seven, we will do evening chanting. Chant one more time. It's like a meditation. We will have short meeting. We will inform that, oh, tomorrow we have big cleaning, tomorrow we will have these duties to focusing on, and after that, it's our free time. So we can 
it's credit to live in individual room or together and learning, you know, do an assignment. And that's our you know, technical day or daily routine of Buddhist month. Good luck everyone. I uh, hope you enjoy your trip and have a safe ride. No problem. Dog so I asked a tour guide and apparently this building is 600 something years old and about 400 years ago there was an earthquake. So you see elephants all the way around. And you can see the spots where they're missing. Yeah, so it was really interesting. Also it's customary to give Two guides a tip, so I'm gonna do that. Here you go. Oh, thank you. You think you're gonna become a Buddhist monk? <laughs> Sounds like a great concept, but I really yeah. like my C500. This one, this one, this one. Have you tried it before? No, I have not. Time to die. Go for it. Go for it. They're gonna ice cream. As I was saying. How is it? It's not too bad. Yeah. Yeah. Okay. There is space. There is space. Oh. Oh. You go in? No. Pretty good. It smells kind of weird, but yeah. tastes good. It does smell weird. Oh man. Even the ice cream stinks. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, it smells really weird. Yeah, I see in, I'm like, oh, okay. yeah this guy is gonna be a... Alright, so, uh, Temples and monks, pretty fun, eh? Um, it's just gonna get crazier from here. We have a reservation for like one of the best restaurants in town. They don't hold reservations for like more than 10 minutes after. And then we have a Muay Thai fight. And we get exclusive seats to that and basically all access to filming whatever the heck we want. That's gonna be crazy, we might get some blood on us. We don't know. But now it's time to get ready for dinner.